So Salman Khan, congratulations. Salman Khan. <laughs> five years of being human. Uh, being human, the clothing line, five years. Right, now. being Charitable human. Charitable Trust, I think, about ten years now. What has surprised you the most? What is the thing that you are proudest of in these ten and five years? Um, <clears throat> the clothing line has been accepted really well and is doing really well. So that is, that's amazing. Yes. And thanks to the fans and people who don't even know who I am, you know, they buy the clothes because they like the concept and they like the quality and they like the, um, the styles and stuff like that. So we've been very fortunate where that's concerned. And that's these five years. You know, actually it started from um, <clears throat> the paintings that I do. Yes. So um, I got some paintings printed on two uh, T-shirts and um, I went to launch um, Mimo's um, music release, yes. um, Mitunda Sun. Yes. So I wore, I wore one of the t-shirts, so you know, the press come and take pictures and stuff like that. So two, three days later, I was passing by Linky Road and um, Hill Road. Um, <coughs> I saw these t-shirts with that painting yeah. on. That's where it it's, all started. So we started being human at a very on a very small level. So we just made one grey t-shirt, one black t-shirt, one white t-shirt, just saying being human. And they sold out and then we took it further and further. further, and further. So now tell me, is there, is there a moment, is there one thing that this trust has done in particular that you are proudest of, that moves you the most, that you are arguably even the most surprised by? It feels good. Um, at the same time, you know, you feel that you've done nothing. It feels good when people, when doctors come and say they don't, you know, you, you're doing a really great, great job. You know, we um, treat a lot of patients who come from your foundation. People who I have never met in my entire life, they come and say that um, our child is there because of that. Um, so, you know, uh, what I do is I don't meet any, anybody. So even the people who want to come and thank me, I don't meet anybody. It's, it's just a weird feeling. It's, it's strange that somebody looking up to you into your eyes and saying that thank you so much you did this. It's not it's no big deal. It's no big deal. I mean, I don't think um, anyone should be um, taking credit for something that you should be doing as as a human being. Yes. It shouldn't be like you know you. But some would say arguably being complimented that's where the reward comes really from. Feeling really good of doing something that you're actually supposed to do. I mean, wish to do a lot more for that. You need to grow a lot more in terms of money. You need to get a lot of, lot of um, donations, which we don't get. That's the reason why we started being human. So, and we don't even want to, you know, ask people, you know, for um, donations or for money, because everyone has their own lives and everyone works really hard and everyone wants to, you know, save that money for you know, their children for the rainy day because you never know what the future holds for you. I hear people saying all the time that, oh, he's done this to change his image. I, yeah, because of the cases and stuff like that. I hear that he's successful today because of being human, because he does some other charity. It's okay that they say it. So, I mean, if it's, this is a, the formula for success, then I think you should also apply it. Fair enough. You should apply it, definitely. And if it's there, if you believe that it's there to change uh, my image, then my image is not changed at all. <laughs> it's, still the, it's still the same. <laughs> but if you do believe that, and if you think that it has changed, then um, thank you. And I think you could try the same. You've also done a campaign where in a, you arguably one of India's most, I suppose for lack of a better word, sung heroes, is teaming up with and highlighting unsung heroes. Yeah. Can you tell me about that, how that happened, who some of these people are? There are these kids, you know, who have belittled me, who have made me look so small that this one 25-year-old kid from Pune. So we just, you know, Film City, you know, there's another route to Film City through RML Colony. So every time you know, you take that route, you see men, women, you know, going in, um, going to the bathroom and toilet outside with umbrellas and stuff like that. So it's that open defecation 
thing. I went and spoke to them and I said, no, kitne. They already had the toilets there, but they had about some 36, 37 of them, but none of them functional because there's no water and there's not well kept and um, no lights and no security. So we got them done chaka chak. So I was telling him, sir, how many have you done? Because we just did this in Animal Colony, this is about 36, 37 done. He's already done 10,000 plus. It's amazing what these guys are doing. There's this one girl who um, employs um, girls and guys and um, ladies to make these clouds. And then she buys them f from them. And then she sells them to boutiques and stuff like that. And all that money goes into charity. <coughs> then there's this one lady who makes uh, pads. And uh, another thing where um, sanitary napkins and then another thing where you you put the pad in after using that and it you know how much ash that a cigarette you know lets out yeah. that much is left of that of that pad and she supplies that at a really really low cost that you can't find anywhere and she does like thousands and thousands of them and she's like 19 years old mm -hmm. so it is the kind yeah. of work that these people are doing with you know such a limited resources it is phenomenal so we started you know getting this research done finding them down tracking them and we got all these all these people to and then yeah so like right now the only one person that i'm following on uh insta is this girl called rene she was she was a small child in um in jeho and she makes these cupcakes and stuff like that and whatever that money that comes, okay, she puts it into um, a charity. How lovely. So there are a lot of people like, for example, the singer Palak, Palak Munchal. Right. She has done more than about 2,000 heart conditions already. Yeah, she, she's been doing this since the age of five. She must be 23, 24 now. So they've done a lot of work. But no matter how much work we do, you know, it still falls short. So I think there should be a lot more people coming out and if you want to show off, you show off. Yeah. If you want to, if it's a guilt in your head, okay, chalo, guilt hai, you know. But make that difference. Make that difference. If you have done something wrong, you have to do you feel better that you have no problem, you have to do this charity. If you have done wrong intentions, if you have done wrong intentions, if you have done wrong do it. Agar badapan ke liye bhi kar rahe ho, to karo, karo. No, fair enough. And, and, and I hope everyone's listening. I have to ask you though, this is, you know, this is again a nice landmark to sort of, you know, towards the end of the year. You've also got like this widely busy December coming up. There's a birthday. There's yeah, the there are lots of, of birthdays. All of us are born in, you know, yeah. November, December. Right. And of course, there is the big release that we are all looking yes, forward to. Yes, um, <laughs> Tiger's, <laughs> Tiger's in there. The I've just started race yesterday. Yeah. yeah. Still, yeah. the trailer's not nearly enough. Yeah, the film would be more than enough. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's shaped up really well. Yeah. So that's it. I mean, you saw the trailer and now yeah. the film is going to release on 22nd. Bus. Do you have any birthday resolutions this year, birthday no. presents that you're hoping for? No, nothing. Oh, come on. Nothing, just, just good health, that's it. For me and for all the loved ones, for everyone, just good health and um, everyone being safe, everyone taking care of themselves and smiling. Most important, everyone smiling. Do you feel like right now there is more than usual for you to smile about? I think that's, that's uh, if, if you, t you talk in terms of uh, charity. Yes. Um, I think that's the biggest uh, charitable thing that you can do. That you look at someone and you greet the person, you give them a nice warm smile. That is the yeah. best charity that anyone can do. So we are going to end now with a brief little rapid fire. Okay. All right, so the first thing is, what is your favorite item of choice? Is it a being human t-shirt or a being human pair of jeans? Oh. Or any other actually of the equipment. I prefer being bare-chested. <laughs> <laughs> this is so it, you know what what the thing is that <coughs> I don't say buy keep on buying being human and keep on buying at least one or two you know clothing thingy should yeah. be in your in your cupboard an e-bike 
a normal bike or anything else? What is Salman's I favorite think model? Me, for, for me right now, it's e-bike. E-bike? Yeah, yeah. It looks like fun. Yeah, it's amazing. <laughs> I've been traveling, I've been riding that all the time. Yeah. I don't feel like sitting in the car anymore. I'm just sitting on the cycle. Jahan pedal manna, pedal maro, jahan Cruise. Pedal nahi karna hai. You're easily touching 25 to 28 kilometers an hour without pedaling. It's your absolute favorite co star amongst all your, your co stars. Absolute favorite. I, Come on, one. I don't have any favorite. But right now, I've had a great time working with Katrina. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, she's lovely. She's. Yeah. yeah she's, she's worked really hard. She's worked so hard in the film. I mean, I feel like. Oh. Like she's just. She's like a hamman. She just keeps on working and working and working. So the action, when you see her in the action sequence, she's done it like on a different level altogether. She's done most yeah, all the stuff herself. And um, kind of risky stuff as well. And very tiring because where we shot it was like 50 55 degrees in Abu Dhabi at that point in time we had a great time so after that after shooting the whole day she used to play cricket for an hour she used to play volleyball for an hour then she used to do pilates and after that she used to go and work out in the gym and yeah all that stuff so then she learned how to play tennis so an hour and a half used to go on tennis so she used to be like Five and a half, six hours, you should just be at it. I don't know where she's got the energy from. What do you consider the first among your sequels? I think Dabang was the first sequel. Yeah. And now we're doing a prequel to Dabang. Yeah. It starts with Dabang 3 and goes back and comes back into, into 3. Your guiltiest pleasure? My guiltiest pleasure? Or is there no pleasure? No, I'm, no guilt. No, no guilt. No guilt. No guilt. No pleasure. Jacqueline Fernandez has said that you are one of the wisest people she's met. So oh, she must have not met a, a, <laughs> not, She's not met a very many people that I, that I know. That if I am the wisest, then she's not met very many people. No, no, no. But <laughs> oh, she's I, lovely. When we talk about Costa yeah, again, yeah, Jackie's yeah. Jackie's one of the one of the most incredible people that you can ever ever come across. Nice. So, what is the best piece of advice you think you've given, and the best piece of advice you've got? Oh, oh yeah, that one. Do whatever you want to do, man, but don't trouble your mother. <laughs> Wise words indeed. All right, if there is amongst this young batch of stars who are coming up, anyone you look at and think could be Varun a Dhaban. successor to the Salman Khan Varun crown? Dhaban. Varun Dhawan? Varun Dhawan. Um, and right now he's going through a rough phase, but uh, I think Suraj Pancholi. Yeah? yeah? Really? To the Salman crown? Uh, you don't know what phase anyone, you don't know that even Salman Khan is going to be at this phase for how, how long, but everyone, I think all these boys will do, like Ranveer is doing really well, um, Suraj Pancholi, um, now uh, Varun Dhawan is like, I love him, absolutely love him. Now Ayush is being launched. Yeah. So now, now my next question is a totally innocuous one. There's no hidden agenda whatsoever in my asking it. I want to be very clear on this. But if someone were to come to you and ask you for advice on proposing to their lady love, what advice would you choose to give them? So you, you need to go and take advice from somebody who's got, you know, first hand experience in these things. I have no experience in this at all. So I could yes. I could like really mess their relationship up for for them right but, but but for those of us hoping that things might change i wonder is oh, there a man. flicker of hope a glimmer on the horizon anything you'd like to share on national television we're very good with secrets yeah i know i just see one baby here i don't see any more lights yeah. uh, sorry baby na this light ko baby bolte na acha 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 Right, this is the only baby <laughs> there. My final question is to all the nosy aunties, uncles and members of the media, myself included, who are constantly obsessed with your personal life, what would you actually like to say to us? I can say a lot. <laughs> I can say a lot. Seriously, I can really say a lot with some 15, 20 um, different expressions and um, choices of words. Um, yeah, but um, it'll have to be... Um, after you switch off the cameras. But on camera, I would say, um, why is everybody so interested? I mean, I should be the one who who's, should be interested. Why is everyone is so interested? Is there some pleasure you're going to get out of it? No. Is there um, some insecurity 
that I'm not married yet. I don't think you should be. No. So, nothing. Yeah. I don't think this is national news. Right, fair enough. And finally, just to your fans. I'm um, just a final message if you want to, them to work there. The most important thing is be safe. Be safe. That's perfect. In all things, Salman Khan, congratulations. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Thank you.